ವಂದೇ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ್ವ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದು ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕ ಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಶಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವಶಕ್ಕೆ ಪಾಸಿಂದು ವ್ಯವಚ ಪತಿನ ಪಾವನೇಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೀಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮುಖಂ ಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗ ಪಂಗುಂಗ್ಲಂಘೈತಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ಬಂದೆ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವೈ ತುಳಸಿದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಸಚ ಕೃಷ್ಣಭಕ್ತಿಪದೆ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರುಂಚೈವ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರೆ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರೋ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರು ಭಕ್ತಿ ಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ಗರು ಧ್ಯೇಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವನ್ನ ವಿಷ್ಟದೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಿರಿಂಚನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ವೇತ್ತಾತ್ಯುಹಂ ಪನುತಪಾಲ್ಭವಾಧಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೇ ಚರುಣಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನಖಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗೋಧೂಷ್ವಾದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗ್ರ ಸ್ವಸಾಗ್ರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾ ಕಿಪಾಂ ಕರೋಷಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಅದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಅದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಆಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನಕಾ ಬುಧಾತ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈಕ ಪಿತರೌ ಕಮಲಾಯುತಾಕ್ಷ ವೀಶಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜವರೌ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾವತಾರೌ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೆ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೇ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿತೋ ದಿವ್ಯೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಾಸಿ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷೀ ತಾಂ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣೋ ಪ್ರಿಯಮನಂಗು ಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾಣಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷು ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಶ ಚ ಭಕ್ಷಸಿ ಜಸ್ತಿ ದಯ ಸಂಬೀತ್ ಸಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 
राम राम हरे अनंत कोटि विष्णु लोक नम्र पद मजार चिते हेमाद्रिजा पुलो मुझा बिरंचिजा बरो अनंत कोटि विष्णु लोक नम्र पद मजार चिते हिमाद्रिजा पुलो मुझा बिरंतिजा बरो प्रदे गौरीय गोष्ठीपति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी जगत बहुपाल परमंश जगदगुरु टोल कृष्ण इज द ओनली एब्सल्यूट ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ ओरशिप इन आवर लाइफ नॉट ओनली इन आवर लाइफ ऑल जीवस इन इन्फिनिटी ब्रह्मांड प्राकृत एंड अप्राकृत जगत बोथ एवरीवेयर कृष्ण इज द ओनली ऑर्सिपेबल ऑब्जेक्ट आवर एंड ओनली ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ एट्रैक्शन इन्फिनिटी जीव दे आर सपोज टू फील एट्रैक्शन बाई कृष्ण कृष्ण नेम कृष्ण इज दिस दिस अ रीजन क्रिश प्लस नो कृष्ण कृष्ण इन आकर्षण नो मीन गिविंग आनंद डायरेक्टली इनडायरेक्टली ऑल डिफरेंट काइंड ऑफ आनंद डायरेक्टली इनडायरेक्टली मेटेरियल और अप्राकृत ऑल आनंद कमिंग फ्रॉम भगवान एनी वे कृष्ण इज द ओनली ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ एट्रैक्शन ओके कृष्ण इज द ओनली ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ आर ओरशिप बट श्रीमती राधा रानी इज द ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ ओरशिप ऑफ भगवान श्री कृष्ण दैट इज द मोर स्पेक्टिकुलर थिंग दे इज द मोस्ट स्पेक्टिकुलर बिकॉज बाई सर्विंग कृष्ण इन सच ए वे बाई सर्विंग कृष्ण एक्सक्लूसिव वे बाई सर्विंग कृष्ण एक्सक्लूसिव वे श्रीमती राधा रानी बिकम एन ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ ओरशिप ऑफ कृष्ण हिमसेल्फ आई मीन कृष्ण गोइन टू ओरशिप राधा रानी ऑल द टाइम एंड वी नो कृष्ण इज एन ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ एट्रैक्शन होल इन्फिनिटी वर्ल्ड बट स्टिल भगवान श्री कृष्ण फीलिंग एट्रैक्शन बाय राधा रानी राधा रानी कृष्ण फीलिंग एट्रैक्शन That is the most spectacular things. Anyway, so long as the conception of man and woman is there, persists inside our heart, till then we have no right to speak the name of Simati Radharan. So long as the conception of man and woman, I mean, material enjoying mood, whatever it may be. Maybe I have no material enjoying mood externally, but I need pratishtha. That is also more dangerous. In that case, we have no right to speak the name, even the name of Radharani. Even the name of Radharani, you cannot speak. So holy name, so pure. That doesn't mean we cannot speak Radhe Radhe. We cannot speak. Not that, but we have no right because because the object. I am going to speak about Simati Radharani or any object. I am good. If it is not within my range, I don't understand the glories of Ram Simati Radharani or any object, anything which is out of my range, which is inconceivable. By watching, I cannot understand. By hearing about Radharani, I cannot understand. I think same thing as a woman. In that case, what we can do? In that case, what is the utility? Simati Radharani name is very good. Even Bhagwan Sri Krishna doing japa, Radhe 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 Radhe. That we know. But what is the utility in our life? Whereas we have no conception who is Radharani. Nothing, no conception who is Radharani. And uh, even after hearing so much Hari Katha about Radha, still we are not. Going to cut our material bondage, we cannot understand. In that case, only 
if we go to discuss all deep philosophy about Srimati Radharani, we can invite some aparat. Only we can invite some aparat. Unnecessarily. We can invite some aparat. Srila Prabhupada speaking, the only object in the life of Bhagavan Sri Krishna is a property. Like you have some property or you have some property, what property? But Prabhupada, after making 64 different Goryamats, different institutions, he is speaking, I am Niskinchan. It's true. It's true. But whereas one man, very clever, is putting so many money and everything in backside as a protection, he is speaking, I am Niskinchan. Not at all. Not at all. It's not Niskinchan. So Prabhupada speaking, Radha, Radharani is the object of worship of Niskinchan Bhakta, Niskinchan Gauriyo Rupanuga Bhakta. Not everybody. Rupanuga Bhakta and Niskinchan, totally Niskinchan. Whereas Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking, I have no property in my life. Huh? What do you say? Infinity, world infinity, Brahmandi, your property? Oh, no. I have no property. I am penniless. I have no property in my life, believe in me or not. The only property I have, the lotus feet of Simati Radharani. Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking, only the lotus feet of Simati Radharani is my only property. That's why I am in this kitchen. Bhagavan not speaking, surely Bhagavan not speaking lie, not speaking lie. Bhagavan personally speaking, Aham niskinchan niskinchan or janair priya. I myself niskinchan and those who are niskinchan they love me. So surely Bhagavan cannot speak lie. Bhagavan speaking, I myself be niskinchan. And those who are niskinchan, they love me. I don't know why. You can find the discussion between Rukini Devi and Bhagavan Sri Krishna and Dharaka. I like to refer this point to Rukini Krishna Bhagavan speaking. I am actually Niskinchan. I am bigger actually, penniless. Why you marry me? You are the daughter of one big king. Better it now you can choose one suitable person to marry. Oh, you marry me. I am Niskinchan. Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking. But Rukini they be explaining properly. And I am very coward, you see. I am coming here. I mean, those who are Shishupal, Adi, they are speaking, a coward, coward, going and making a place inside ocean, you know. Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking, I have no power, no money, nothing. Are you unnecessary marry me? I can give you a chance. Better you can select one suitable person to marry. Rukini Devi. Hello. Cannot be here. Rukini Devi thinking, surely Krishna is going to leave me. I am going to fall down on ground. And after that, after getting back consciousness, Rukini Devi speaking, you are really staying secretly inside the heart of everybody, but nobody have any information. You have any information? Bhagavan is there. You can talk with Bhagavan. Looking outside. Our prajna, our all sense organ, going to search outside world to get some facility. Business, we are business minded. Even our mind is not looking inside. Even Atma Tattva, the basic thing. What to speak about Radha Govindo? I am not going to speak tall, tall, big, big, you know. Even Tattva Gyan, Atma Tattva, we don't have Atma Tattva. Who am I? What will happen? I promise you, if you realize Atma Tattva, immediately you can cut connection with outside world. You can concentrate inside yourself. You can search inside. Because all property they are inside, not outside. What property you are going to search outside? Nothing there. Foolish. 
Mano rathe no asato dhavato vahi. We are asat. Asat bin? Our concentration is there in material things. Even we cannot withdraw our mind from matter to concentrate on the lotus feet of Guru Padma. This is the painful condition. Mano rathe no asato dhavato vahi. Sitting in the chariot of mind, mind can be compared with chariot. Anywhere you can go without any visa, passport, Shah, you can go. America, Russia, France, Italy, wherever you like. You can go. So mind can be compared with a nice chariot. And within fraction of second you can go anywhere. Almost within no gapping of time, you can go anywhere. So fast is this mind. So mind is busy with all material things. How we can discuss about Radharani? We like to discuss. But what to discuss? How to discuss? Where is the qualified person, Popa speaking? So Bhagavan Sikh is now speaking that really I am Niskinchan because the only property, the only property I have in my life is the lotus feet of Simati Radharani. Nothing else, I have no property. You think infinity woman, no? I don't think. Anyway, Popa speaking, after reading whole Bhagavatam, 18,000 sloka, you are so intelligent, you are so learned, you are so elevated devotee, that you cannot even find the name of Radharani. Where is the name of Radharani? Oh, whole Bhagavatam is search out. No, name of Radharani is not there. Yes. Prabhupada speaking, yes. Prabhupada speaking, yes. After reading whole Bhagavatam, if I cannot find the name of Simati Radharani, then all my reading Bhagavatam is useless. All gone to drain. Brain drain, you know. At the time of British people, they used to apply this brain drain. You have brain. They can call, oh, you are very intelligent. They can use it in such a seva that without your information, you can lose all your, all your you know, life, 10 years gone. After that, they throw your brain into drain. That is called brain drain. Now, this is the, our preaching procedure. Yes, I am sitting in Vyasas and if I speak lie, I can die. This is our preaching, brain drain. Preaching means who can, who can mold, who can mold common people so nicely, mold. Brain drain. It's called brain drain, we like to brain drain. So that he cannot utilize or she cannot utilize his brain. Brain actually we cannot use for Hari Bhajan until and unless the brain intellect going up to a practical level. But still, we can try. In Bhajan level we can try. I mean, we can try. So, Papa speaking, right you are. For whom the name of Radharani can be given in Bhagavatam? For you? For whom the name of Radharani can be given? Very safely? Because Krishna Das Kavira Goswami writing in Chaitanya Chaitamito, Jar lagi koite boy sejoni na jani. I fear to speak this all secret in front of material demonic people. But if by chance, if they cannot understand, I can try to represent the facts and Siddhanta in such a way, common people can say, eh, nothing. It's good for me. Krishna Kovidas Goswami is speaking, I like to speak so many secret things, but I fear. Because those material people, they can utilize it for their own purpose. Dirty application. So in Bengali, it is written in Krishna Das Kovidas Goswami writing, Jar lagi kohite boy sejonida jani. I fear to speak the same for those demonica. If at all they cannot realize, then I am very happy. Anyway, I love to speak something because there can be some devotees crying to get the lotus feet of the Prabhupada. They are trying. Who can say? Any corner of the world, some people crying. Day and night to know the fact. Not that everybody likes to hear all rubbish, you know, glamour, position, not that. Not that. Some people can be there. They like to know about their absolute truth. 
So they are searching where we can get that kind of sadhu. Where we can get, who can give the message of a Prakriti Jagat intact way without changing dot, full stop, nothing. Who can? Changing mean you're going to apply something of your own brain. Sure. So, Papa speaking, well, after reading whole Bhagavatam, if we are not going to get the clue of Simati Radharani, then all our readings, whole Bhagavatam is useless. All gone. Because whole Bhagavatam, whole Bhagavatam, Janma Adasya Yatu, I can show you. If I discuss, because time is limited. From Janma Adasya Yatu, from there up to Nama Sankirtanam Jasu, all speaking, all the glorification of Simati Radharani. All. Indirectly, directly, all speaking about Simati Radharani. Directly or indirectly? First of all, from first canto to ninth canto, different kings and everything, all okay. But indirectly, they are going to indicate the lotus feet of Simati Radharani. The heart of Bhagavatam is Simati Radharani. The heart of Bhagavatam, Krishna is, yes, is right Siddhanta. Because Krishna himself is Bhagavatam. Krishna Parivartito. Shukdev Goswami speaking, Srimad Bhagavatam, Shakshat Krishna Evahi. Evahi affirmative. Srimad Bhagavatam Mahapuran, no other than Krishna, but in the form of Aprakita Sabda Brahma. Okay? And the heart of Krishna is Srimati Radharani. So if I speak the heart of Bhagavatam is Radharani, what wrong in it? Right, Siddhanta? Popa speaking, for whom? For whom? The name of Radharani can be given clearly in the Bhagavatam. A foolish like you, idiot like you, give. Why? Pobat speaking, that Sukhdev Goswami wanted to conceal, wanted to keep a secret. That is a very, very costly jewel, invaluable thing. If you have, Jewel or something. Surely you cannot uh, show in public, oh, I have some, uh, you know, this jewel and gold coin, everything. Everybody can kill you and take. So, surely, if you are going to discover some secret property from underground, you are not going to. By chance, in Puri, just uh, two, four years back, government discovered huge amount of property. Oh, huge amount of, enormous amount of property. So, those were secret property. They should be kept secretly. Because it is not cheap thing. So that common people can come and take the advantage to know. Not that. So, Papa speaking, for whom the name of Radharani can be given in Bhagavatam? For an idiot and foolish like you, who can misuse and utilize it? Actually, Sukhdev Goswami wanted to speak the glorification of Srimati Radharani very much. But he wanted to check himself. Whenever the name of Radharani coming, he is going to break down. Break down means Vikar. Ashtasattik Vikar coming. He cannot speak Harikatha. Like the case of Prabhupada. Like the, our case of Prabhupada, Bhakti Siddhanta He started explaining Upadishamrita. <coughs> In Radha Kundo, in Kartik Brata, started speaking. Whenever the name of Radharani coming, then Prabhupada cannot speak. His body shaking, and our tears coming, voice choked up. Immediately like to check himself because this kind of exclusive Baba should not be expressed in front of public. This is a teach. This is the cheating, this is the teachings of Siman Mahaprabhu. This is a direct teaching of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. You can go through Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Whenever Mahaprabhu feeling some ecstatic feeling, and outside people there, it is written there, I can show you. Mahaprabhu, 
immediately try to check, immediately try to check, check up himself. It's written. Immediately, Mahaprabhu wanted to check himself because he never liked to express this kind of thing in front of open public. But at present, apparently, everything can know about the secret Lila of Radharani. They are going to throw out all our Bhakti Thakur, Prabhupada, everything. So big they are. They are worshipable. They are our worshipable. They like to throw Bhakti Thakur, Prabhupada, everything. Bhakti Thakur, hundreds of times in different places I can show you. Speaking, this kind of thing should not be discussed in open public. Because common public, they are foolish. They don't understand. But we say it's all okay. Everything okay. They are speaking. So this way, Guru Padma used to say, that even Prabhupada used to put some restriction in reading Srimad Bhagavatam openly. Everybody not cannot read. Papa say if you read even Bala Lila, even Bala Lila, if you develop some material conception, then you big problem can be there. I heard directly from Guru Maharaj, Guru Padpam told. So restriction, Siddhar Goswami Maharaj, Kesav Goswami, all Bhakti Puri, they are so restriction are putting. Why? Papa speaking. Anaya miyate iti maya. Anaya miyate iti maya. And anaya raditam iti radha. The name of Simati Radharani is there, but nobody can discover. They are blind, na? There are no Guru Anagata, nothing. They speak, we don't need Patishta. They need Patishta. They cannot touch the lotus feet of Nishinga, they speak, we don't know. The symptom of such sadhu is rare. Who can speak without any fear openly? He cannot conceal anything. You want to conceal. That's why? Because you need some Pratishta. Otherwise, why you are not going to confess the absolute truth, fact? Why are you going to suppress? Why? That's mean? You have no right to speak about Harikatha. No right. Because you like to reserve something backside. You are not, your heart is not open heart. You cannot speak about what is the fact, why you are not speaking. Maximum they can kill you, they have money power. That you can do. Anyway, we'll have to die. Why not you die for Prabhupada? The Prabhupada, why not you die? Anyway, you are going to die. Mayadavi is going to kill you. Anyway, you are going to die. Mayadavi is going to kill you, can strangle your. And so, so why not you give your life? For all our, in you know, a freedom fighter, they wanted to give life for motherland. At least they had some seriousness, sincerity. We don't have. Even that thing we don't have. We are not following Guru Varga properly. So how we can discuss about who is Radharani? Who can? So, Pope was speaking, Anaya Radhito. Is called Radha, giving indication of Radharani. And Miyate Anaya Iti Maya. Miyate Anaya Iti Maya is the indication of Maya. If you have some mood, uh, I like to check up how much power that sadhu have, how much knowledge. Yeah, let me see. With this mood, you cannot come to hear Harikatha. You can get cheated. You can develop aparad also. Big problem. So, we have always, always we have one mood of how measure. We like to measure, you know. With our, we have some measuring instrument, I mean, we have our mind have some doubt, suspicion, everything. We like to measure everything. So with this measuring mood, you can never come in front of Sadhu Guru Vaishnava. With full surrendered mood, you will have to come, otherwise you can get the negative result. 
big problem will be there. So Baba speaking, Miyate Anaya Iti Maya and Anaya Radhito, this is called Radharani. Radharani and Govindaji, I mean Bhagavan Sri Krishna, non different from each other. It's not only false philosophy. I know you can say, oh, oh Maharaj is false philosophy. Not false. Not false. Is, is a hundred percent perfect thing in different sastra. You can go to the glorification of Bhagavatam in, uh, you know, Skanda Puran, Padma Puran also, different glorification. There you can find. There you can find it is clearly written. Sha Eva Sha. Who is he? She is he. He is she. Many Radha and Govinda are non different from each other. That is why Srila Krishna Kaviraj Gosabi wanted to write some. Sloka in the beginning of Chaitanya Chaitamitra about about Bhagavan Gauranga At the time of Gaur Purnima, we usually we are discussing there. You can find there Krishnadas Kubidas Goswami is speaking that Sarup Gosai wanted to represent this sloka too. Very nice, nice sloka. About Radha Govindu. Unification of Radha Govinda, when Radha Govinda submerge with each other and take the form of Gauranga. It is not only false philosophy, it is, it is proven, already proved by, by Rai Ramananda. After finishing Rai Ramananda Sangbad, there you can find Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Gauranga Mapu exposing this. Radha Govindo, Raramandu watching. Radha Govindo, immediately submerged and going to give the golden completion. Then Raimasa asking, Who are you? Speak. Who are you? I am a sadhu sannyasi actually. No, you speak. Who are you? Don't try to cheat me. Actually, I see. Actually, you are Mahabhagavata. Mahaprabhu is going to cheat Rai Ramananda. Actually, you are Mahabhagavat, na? So, Mahabhagavat actually are uh, watching Bhagavan everywhere. In you, he, see everywhere. They are not watching woman, man, rich, poor. Always watching everywhere. Everywhere Bhagavan Sri Krishna. That's why you are watching. Don't speak Prabhu this way. You speak out, who are you? I see this way. That Krishna is there by the body color of Simati Radharani. You are going to cover your body and going to take, you know, you know, going to take advantage of relishing, going to get the taste of how Radharani love me. What is the and how? What kind of feeling Radharani? Uh, getting by watching, I myself cannot understand but how this way. Ultimately, Mahaprabhu was bound to speak. Ultimately, Mahaprabhu was bound to confess in front of Rai Ramananda. Please don't speak to anybody actually. You are actually crazy, I am actually petty. Go too crazy, one place. Too crazy, you are crazy. Ah, I'm also crazy. Actually, Rasaraj Mahabhab, Rasaraj or Mahabhab, all save some much. So it is practical thing. Shoye Vasa and Rai Ramananda directly could realize that Gauranga Mahaprabhu is Radha and Govindo Milita Vigraha. Radha Govinda Milita Vigra already is proved. So, according to Vedanta Siddhanta, we know Shakti Shakti Matur Avet. This is general concept. This is one very right conception from 
Vedanta. In Vedanta it is written, Shakti Shakti Matur Abhed. I mean, Shakti Man, Purush, and the Shakti energy, I mean, is one and the same. Shakti Shakti Matur Abhed. Shakti Man and Shakti non different prakriya. But here are some special case. In material world, if some hero, heroine going to love each other, try to understand, not dirty thing. Try to get the point. In this material world, if one hero, heroine going to love each other, so extreme love, and they are going to embrace each other. Suppose they are going to embrace each other. But still, they cannot get one form. Still it is separated. Though they can embrace each other, but this is okay, but still they are separate. But this is not the case with Radha Govind. Radha Govind though when going to embrace each other, that's why it's one kind of, you know, paste and make one and same. No question of any separate existence, but still separate. No question of any separate existence, Gorang Mahapu. But still, it is separate. This is called Achinta Vedavet Tattva. By applying your brain, intellectual power, you cannot find any solution. So most of the people, they are speaking, Achinta Vedavet means I inconceivable. They are speaking, oh, Achinta means I inconceivable. But this is not the exact meaning. But this is not the exact meaning. Achinto means okay, inconceivable. But that doesn't mean I can never know. I can never realize. It can be realized. But, but under the guidance of Simati Radharani. I mean, under the guidance of Bhakti Chakur, Prabhupada, Kesha Mahat, this way. Not directly. If we can reach up to that level, then surely we can realize it. Not that we can. Achinto doesn't, achinto doesn't mean okay, inconceivable is okay. But beyond your knowledge, beyond your imagination power, there is another level that you never stop to think. That is called the, the platform of love platform of extreme love. Follow. Beyond our imagination level, beyond our intellectual everything, there is one platform that we never could realize. That is called one platform of love. Extreme, absolute love. If we can reach up to that level of love, in that case we can find solution of the problem. No argument can be there. If we can reach up to that level of love, extreme love, point, like Brajavas is, in that case we can realize, but not before that. So, achinto doesn't mean never can be known, it can be known. Because our Guru Vargo wanted to show us this way, this way if you go exactly, if you are sincere, if you are going to sacrifice your life for the for Guru Seva, we are not going to sacrifice Allah. We say we sacrifice. We can give something to Guru Deva, raise up something backside. You can ask yourself. Better you can ask yourself. You, you go inside one room, lock the room, and ask in front of the mirror, you stand and you ask that you are cheater or not you are perfect. You go and ask in front of mirror. You can see, you can fear. Really, I'm cheater. I never wanted to give everything to Guru Dev. That's why you are not getting. Why people not getting the lotus feet of Gauranga? Why people cannot get the lotus feet of Radha Govinda? Why? Because they don't want. Because they don't want. But what do you say? Yes. 
demand is not there. If demand is there, supply can be made. This is the formula of economics. This is the basic formula of economics. I can show you the graph chart. Demand and supply. This article commodity, this year demand this, this year demand this, price increasing, then I can show you high parabola, high parabola. Those who are doing higher mathematics, they have idea. High parabola. So demand surely not there. Pope speaking, who is going to sacrifice his own life? Hundred percent, hundred percent is there. No cheating. He can get this life. Pope told. He need not wait. This life he can get. But we have no demand. We are doing tilak mala everything, doing association, but association should be perfect. Many times, Popat wanted to say, if you are Sarvakalik, you know, Sanskrit, Sarvakalik association, I mean, your good association, you should ensure that the association you are doing, 100% perfect and non-stop, no, no breakage, no, there is no gapping. Follow what I mean to say, very scientific thing. Everybody is thinking, I am doing satsang, okay? After this satsang, you can go to do some satsang also. Who can say? Hello. So, Prabhupada wanted to say, non-stop satsanga should be there. You will have to ensure in your life that I am doing non-stop satsanga. And if you at all doing non-stop satsanga, then in Vaisasana I can promise by touching Bhagavatam. Then you can get the object, but you are not getting. Because 100% demand not there. 100% demand, I need it. Do or die. Either I can reach the lotus feet of Bhagavan or I can die. This is my challenge in my life. Whole world can attack me for speaking the absolute truth. Still I can go on speaking about the absolute truth. Standing under, under the umbrella like shelter of Guru Padmo, I can never stop speaking about that absolute truth. I can never stop. Maybe the whole world can leave me. Okay, you go. I never invite anybody. I say don't come. Because if you come, I cannot give honor, proper honor to you. A big problem will be there. So, I never invite anybody. Never. You cannot find any. Because some problem can be there. Follow. Anyway, so, if you follow the if you follow the whole, whole Leela Vilas of Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati, whole Leela of Prabhupada, if you follow, you can find the application of the formula shown by Radharani. In one sentence, I like to say, Radha Dasho was completely there in the life of Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Thakur in the life of Bhakti Vinod Thakur is called Radha Dasho. Not a matter of joke. To pass lecture is very easy. To pass lecture is very easy. To apply in my own life, I know. If people find one leakage, they can kill me. One slight leakage. So I have to be always aware in each and every action. There should not be even any mistake, a slight mistake should not be there. Then I have the right to speak that way, otherwise no. Which is more important for us, to realize the technique of Krishna Bhajan. Who can teach us? From whom? Many times I told, if you are going to accept one fallen soul in your life, as your idealism, there is no possible, don't come to me. Don't come to me, you go away. If you like to accept one fallen soul, as your idealism in your life, what I can do? What I can do for you? Because ABC idea you don't have, what I can do? Radha Dasha is the most secret thing in Gauriya Vajan. Radha Dasa is the most secret thing in the life of Gauriya Bhajan. I mean those who are following 
Rupanuga Dara. Raganuga is an open term. Somebody can follow the Baba of, you know, Shakka Vasala. I am not speaking. Particularly. Particularly, you will have to be very careful. One by one, if I discuss, I can show that all the strange behavior, all the strange behavior and activity, all the strange Siddhanta which are of Prabhupada, the Prabhupada, is all going to prove the Radha Dasha. All, Keshav Goswami Maharaj, Siddhar Goswami, they are all in their life, they are not openly speaking. Oh, we have no idea, they are speaking. But there, there is symptom there. Those who, are, those who are elevated up to that level, they can realize. By, by materialize, you cannot understand who is in what position. You cannot understand. But you can realize someday. If you are going to follow our Guru Varga, I mean our Gauriya Dara, Prabhupada Bhakti Thakur, then you can understand. I can come down to any level for the preaching of Gauriya Vani. I can come down to any level. Even people can fight with me. People can say, you have no ethical character. Okay, you speak. But I like to come down to any level for the actual preaching of Gauriya Vani. This is called Radha Dasha. I, can, I am ready to go to hell for infinity period. If I like to serve Paramahansa Gurudev, my Paramahansa, to serve, to serve my Paramahansa Gurudev, if I need to go to hell for infinity period with due contact, I am ready to go. This is called Radha Dasha. You cannot realize. You cannot understand. Radha Dasha it is. I can provide a fist of fury to change the dirty concept of this material world to rectify their conception i am ready to i am so you know ego not false ego i cannot say false ego ego because this ego is pure ego i am gurudas sila baman Goswami can say he has his right i am gurudas but everybody cannot say everybody cannot say they have given nothing to gurudev what they have given what they have given to Gurudev? Nothing they have given. So they have no right to speak that way. So, Srimati Radharani, all his technique, how to cheat material people. How to cheat material people. And to engage yourself in Hari Bhajan. That is one technique. Shown by Simati Radharani. That is a technique. You cannot fight with public. You cannot fight with public. But you can engage them in such a way you can focus your mind in Hari Bhajan. But externally you are doing something else. Many times Prabhupada told. Prabhupada used to invite all important personalities in the Sava. That is also Radha Dasha. Oh, Prabhupada used to give honor to all, you know, you are great personality. You are speaking so nice Harikatha. Oh, you will have to speak this way, you know, all the time. Prabhupada speaking to some, some of his disciples also, giving honor. But those all secrecy is there, all Radha Dasha. All Radha Dasha, all same. Like Jotila, Kutila. One thing very important, Prabhupada always used to say, Prabhupada very often used to say that to do Hari Bhajan, you will have to face countless problems in your life. If you like to do actual Hari Bhajan, then you will have to face countless problems in your life. Countless problems can come in your life. Different people can criticize, can chase you, attack you. But still, Papa speaking, don't try to live Hari Bhajan. Don't try to pass away Hari Bhajan. You will have to take resolution that I 
will do Hari Bhajan. Without Hari Bhajan, I cannot do anything. That you will have to take resolution. Like Srimati Radharani, always searching scope, all the time serving. Srimati Radharani is serving Krishna non stop seva. There is no gapping. There is no gapping in the life of Radharani. All the time Radharani is doing seva, non-stop seva. If you see Radharani is away from Krishna, she has mental seva going on, mentally seva going on, non-stop seva going on. But Jyotila Kutila don't allow. Jyotila Kutila always searching some leakage. Oh, you are doing maybe some character, loose character. Oh, Nandanandan's character is not good. I, uh, you must, uh, you know, protect. You must protect Radharani, I Radha, from the, from the eyesight of Krishna. That's very dangerous, speaking. Follow. All this thing, and all the time, Jatila Kutila making some problems so that Radharani cannot get the scope to serve Krishna. But anyway, they are also very clever. They are going to arrange the situation in such a way that Jyotila Kuti is bound to accept this point. Huh? For the improvement of the business of Ayangos, Ayangos, you know, externally, Ayangos is the husband of Radharani. But not that. Ayangos not is the servant. He is actually servant, not husband. Externally, we see the arrangement. There is some, uh, some Puran, there is some, I don't like to touch it. So, Ayan goes, never going to touch Radharani. Only the conception there. Follow. Actually, Radharani is eternal, eternally present with Krishna. Follow. Is there any present with Krishna? That there is no question of any husband. Where from the question of husband coming? Only when this Aprakita Leela coming down is material world, then the concept of husband, wife is coming. Actually, Yogamaya, it is the arrangement of Yogamaya. It is the arrangement of Yogamaya going to show, because the more there is impediment, those who are going to, uh, uh, those, those who are going in Himalayan, Everest there, different kind of adversity they like to face. They are feeling thrill. They are feeling thrill. Oh, so much problem. Ah, they are feeling thrill. This way, if in the material world, in Aprakita world, there is no Krishna, eh, there is no Kangsa, there is no Kangsa, no Agasur, Bhagasur, nothing there. No Jyotila, Kutila, no Ayan goes. In Aprakita Yoga, only the concept of only the concept of Jatila, Kutila, everything. Only the concept, not actually. But when that Aprakita Leela coming here in the material world, just like human being, then it is the arrangement of Jogmaya. Jogmaya is going to arrange the situation in such a way so that Lalita, Abhishaka, Radharani can think we have husband. We have to obey. Have some regulation na, in the society. If we break the rules and regulations of society, everybody can criticize. I am the wife of this, this conception coming. Actually, not so. Ananda chinmaya raso pratibhavi tabhi tabirja eva nijarata nijarva taya kalavi. This shloka Brahma Sangita. You can go through, you can get the clue. It's one very secret thing. All those gopikas, they are not women. All sarusakti. The conception of man who are not applicable here. All their sarup sakti. Ananda chinmaya rasa pratibhavi tabi. Stavir jayeva nijurupottaya kalavi. But people, idiot people, having some conception, oh, Krishna doing it, Krishna doing it. They are going to find fault with Krishna. They want to prove the character of Krishna is useless. Rascal number one. Those research scholars, they are going to make research and those foolish rector are going to and accept it. All foolish conception. With material bend, they like to apply here in research. But it is not an object of research. 
Radha Govindu, Gorang, Gorang Mahapu about Gorang Mahapu, Radha Govindu, you cannot uh, and do some research and know and submit some thesis and get some doctorate, you know. We make urine and stool on this kind of, we make urine and stool on this kind of, you know, paper. This kind of paper, doctorate paper, you get, we make urine and stool directly. So idiot people. They like to make research about Bhagavan, you know. It's not, you know. So this way, Srimati Radharani going to search out the moment. Jotila speaking. Jotila speaking. Kundalata, Kundalata, you are going to take Radha in the house of Nanda Baba by the request of Jasudama. But be careful. There should not be any problem. It's chesty lady. It's so chesty lady. Really chesty lady. Radharani is so chesty lady that even all infinity, in infinity world, wherever world, all in a Shakti there, Arundhuti, you know, all, you know, they all, they are, they are searching the chastity of Simati Radha. But people cannot understand. People think otherwise. The chastity is of Radharani in infinity world topmost. The chastity of Simati Radharani to Arundhuti or a different, different, or no, all Sakti. Follow. They always expecting the kippa of Simati Radha. The sloka I started with, no? Anand Koti Vishnu Loko Namra Paramat Padma Yarchite Himadriya Pulomo Ya Biranchi Jayop. This is all I told. So they all shrugging their head, bend their head unto a lotus feet of Simati Radha and they are craving for kippa. You give me kippa, kippa. What to speak about all this infinity sakti in the infinite world? All avatar, all sakti, they are coming. All from Radharani. From the nail, nail there is some light coming from the nail of Simati Radharani. And from that nail, all Lakshmi, Adi, all coming out. All coming out. In infinity world. There is different avatar. But avatar, Bhagavan Sri Krishna is the original cause of all avatar. And Simati Radharani is the root cause of all Shakti. Like with Baraha, Lakshmi Devi coming, all coming from. Sita Devi coming, where from coming? From Radharani. Nishinga Devi with Nishinga Devi, Lakshmi coming, okay. Who's coming this? All coming from, even in Daroka, Rukini, Shatabhyama, Jambati, who not everybody. They can find their existence unto the lotus feet of Simati Radharani. They are all coming from that source. So, Kundalata, be careful. It's very chastity lady, Radha, be careful. You are going to the house of Nanda Maharaj by the request of, you know, oh, I cannot, uh, because Jasuda is very nice, you know, it's very friendly, giving so much donation. Main thing is donation. Main thing is donation. <laughs> He's very greedy. Uh, so much donation you give, then you can very happy. Oh, you can take Kundala. Oh, you don't think. Even the shadow of your, uh, you know, you know, this Radha cannot go there. I am so careful. Kundala is going. And on time, coming back. So if you are going to maintain the time, the Kundalata developing faith, okay, Kundala. Kundalata, I mean Jotila, Kutila, they faith, grow faith. Oh, it's time, on time is coming back. So now uh, you can go to worship and uh, Sujanan Bhagavan. Yes. So you make arrangement or making arrangement. All. Sun God. Because by worshipping Sun God, it is the conception of whom? Jotila. If I allow Radha to worship, Surjana and Bhagavan, they can get more property, more cows and gold ornament, you know, land and property. So, 
You can go. Yes, I can go. I can never disobey you. I have to arrange. I'm going to arrange every flower, fruits, everything, all. Everything. Then with Kundalata, they are going there in Surya Kund. Mid Midday Leela. Madhupan Surya Puja Khala. Going there. But where there is very secret Leela going on, this way, Jotila are going to check up. Actually, they are worshipping uh, Sujan Bhagavan or doing something else. Then Jotila can. Kundalata. Or you can arrange your nice priest, Pujari, who can worship. Don't speak actually. I search whole Mathura. I get this, you know, this disciple of Gargamuni. Actually, Krishna is Krishna. Krishna in the guise of, you know, in the guise of Brahman. Ah, only I find this very powerful Brahman, Brahmachari. He can never touch anybody. Oh, it's very nice. Then you can arrange. Then going to worship. After worshiping everything, ah, he is also a nice astrologer. Okay. Then I can give some donation. You can request uh, that, you know, Brahmachari to watch the hand of Radha, Radharani. Actually, he is Brahmachari. He is not catching. Uh, okay, okay, you can, from distance, can see. This way, Radharani going to make full of, you know, full of Jatila Kutila and going to serve. That is the technique. That is the technique you will have to learn. How to serve Krishna. Very nice technique. You can make full of whole world and you can engage yourself in absolute Krishna bhajan by the guidance of Bhakti Thakur Prabhupada, everything. I mean, under the guidance of Radharani. Bhagavan Sri Krishna always want to get the dust particle from the lotus feet of Srimati Radharani. Dust particle, which is very rare. Because Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking, Srimati Radharani is my guru. Is my guru, na? Krishna thinking. We know the sloka. Krishna Bande Jagat Guru. Krishna is Jagat Guru. But the Jagat Guru Krishna, his Guru is Simati Radha. He is speaking himself. In Chaitanya Jana, you can find. Radhikar Prem Guru, Ami Shishya Nath, Jakhan Jai Chen Nachaya, Toi Chen Nachiya Udvad, Bengali. He is speaking. He is written there. Radharani is my Guru. And when, according to the gesture, is going to gesture, I'm dancing. Follow. There is a condition. So the Guru of Krishna is Simati Radharani. So always Bhagavan Sri Krishna like to get the dust particle from the lotus feet of Simati Radharani, which is very rare. Very rare. Sometime Krishna going to make such a leela, Radharani become angry. Radharani become angry. There is so secret reason I don't like to touch all these things. Radharani become angry. Because Krishna going here and there, he promised to come here, then it is unbearable, then Srimadhi Radharani is speaking, you get out from here. I don't like to see your face. Then finally Krishna requesting you, excuse me, whatever mistake I have done, you excuse me. But still Radharani that day not going to excuse. Finally, Krishna was bound to go away from Kunja, going away. When Krishna gone, then Srimadhi Radharani brushed into tears and speaking, Lalita, why you not stop Krishna? But you already told to go him away, get out from here. So he gone. But you know my heart. You know my heart. How you allow him to go, how I can live now. The condition. The mood of Radharani you cannot understand. You cannot understand. Even the angry attitude of Simati Radharani are for Krishna Seva. Even the angry attitude shown by Radharani, it is for absolute Krishna Seva. Why you go there? I know your test. I can serve you. Why you go there? You are uh, suffering. Even the angry attitude of Simati Radharani is for 
absolute seva of Krishna. So don't try to misuse this kind of thing. Sometimes Radha group and Chandravali group there is fighting. But that fighting you are going to compare in your dirty fighting inside your society. You like to compare this kind of fighting of you know Radhika Chandra will like to apply this formula in your you know dirty society. Male material man. You like to get some advantage. But Popa said no. This is not possible. When love and rapture happening for the excellent, unique, unique purpose of Krishna Seva, when love and, love and rapture going there, love and rapture can be there, but for the unique purpose of Krishna Seva, that can be accepted. But when there is a conception of some personal interest is there, all dirty, all dirty. You can have countless good qualities, countless, maybe. But if you have one very dirty quality, no submission under the lotus feet of Prabhupada, Bhakti Chakur, or you have no love for Gauriya Sampradaya, then all your endeavor, preaching effort, all gone to zero. Zero, sub-zero level. It's the Siddhanta, like mathematics. Like mathematics. Just like mathematics, no? I can prove it. You have no faith for Guru Varga, Guru Parampara, no? or you are fallen soul. Whatever preaching you have done, that we are less interested. We like to see, because this is a symptom of a sadhu. This is the unique symptom of a sadhu. You can detect. Of course, if you are in neutral position, otherwise you can make some, try to make some reconciliation. This is the main thing. If you have tremendous love of Gurudev and Guru Varga, Shuddha Vaishnava, Parampara, then you are sadhu. Otherwise, you can preach whole life, but your preaching is all useless. But preaching means, preaching means to deliver deep kiba to others through Guru Parampara. So, guru, your Guru Parampara is choked up, choked up. You are not getting kiba. You can criticize, they are all gone. Everything stopped. You cannot get. Whole world can solve, but Prabhupada can say no. Srinivas Ajya speaking this. <coughs> anyway, <coughs> today is a <coughs> Abhirbhav Tithi of Srimati Radharani. We will have to touch this point also. So many important points left, but what to do? We have no time. Abhirbhav means Bhagavan out of his own mercy coming here. That is called Abhirbhav. Abhirbhav means Bhagavan out of his soul. Causeless mercy coming here to best to keep on us. Simati Radharani is the original Guru. <coughs> except Radharani, Rupa writing, <coughs> except Radharani, the mad elephant like Krishna, no controlling. Nobody can get control over Krishna. Rupa Goswami is writing, where I cannot speak, because you can buy book and start reading, and you can fall down. So I cannot speak the, I cannot speak the name of the book. So, Radharani, only Simati Radharani, having, controlling over Krishna. Krishna is the, like mad elephant, infinity world, you know, Krishna playing with infinity, nobody can get control. So the point first I wanted to speak, I like to clarify. So love and rapture when going to happen for the unique and common purpose of absolute Krishna Seva. That can be given salute, very good. But if there is some other point, then we cannot accept. Very careful. Now at present there is the main confusion in the whole world about who is sadhu, who is not sadhu, what is harikatha, what is not harikatha. People are in confusion. They are great confusion, not confusion, whole world in darkness. So anyway, very important point, very important point. 
Someday, Shabya, I mean the Sakhi of Chandravali, going to speak to, they apply, they engage some spy, you know, you go, Krishna is there, you go, Krishna is there. They are going to read, and going to Shabya, going to get a nice information, and going to speak to Chandravali, Chandravali, oh, that was a great, nice news. What news? Breaking news. What break? Radharani is going to die. You can get the facility to, to you know, get Krishna along. You can get. Chandra will become very angry. You say, idiot rascal number one. Eh? You are going to give me this message, this good message? This you think good message? I can accept? Are foolish. For Simothi Radharani, we are somehow getting the chance to get Krishna. If Radharani is gone, Krishna can get lost. Rascal, you are going to give this message to me? Huh? Foolish? It's a good message. For Radharani, we are getting Krishna. If no Radharani, no. All bad. So you see, this is called unique purpose of Krishna Seva. So, Abhir Baba Radharani, I can touch some point under the guidance of Bhakti Bhavaturi Goswami, Bhakti Vinod Thakur, all. I like to touch some point only. Actually, <coughs> In Padapuran, in, in other places you can get some information about the Abhir Baba Radharani. Somewhere it is written from the Jagya fire, Simati Radharani coming out. You can get this information. Vishwan Maharaj and Nimanya from Degya getting that. Why not? Actually, Dupodi also came out of fire. So it's very. And somewhere it is written, Patapuran, it is written that someday Vishwanu Maharaj going to Jamuna to take bath there. Suddenly he discovered one lotus flower. There he discovered one baby, very small, very nice baby. Going to collect that baby and going to accept and embrace and come to the house and hand over this baby to Kirti Daswandari. You can say why Maharaj two different kind of conception. You can ask this one. Why? One thing we can accept regarding the disappearance of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. There is so many conception going on. Can see confusion. Even still today, those idiot people are going to write some dirty thing about Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Somebody Speaking, Gorang Mahapu going to enter into Jagannath temple and and there Sabma, you know, submerge. Somebody speaking in Tota Gopinath, entering into Tota Gopinath, submerge. Somebody says, no, somebody has seen Chaitanya Mahapu running in the sea, many over sea, walking and going away. So all three conceptions is right, according to their Capacity they are watching, follow. According to their capacity they are watching, according to their capacity they are watching. So, possibility there, Mahaprabhu going there, and somebody speaking, submerged in Tatagopina, somebody submerged in Jagannath temple. So, well, okay. regarding Nathananda Babu's disappearance, also, nobody understands. You cannot find the samadhi of Gauranga, Nityananda, Advaita, they all disappear. But people like to apply bread. Even about Krishna's disappearance. Mahaprabhu directly told to Sanatan, Sanatan, regarding the disappearance of Krishna, regarding the infighting between Jadavas, regarding the abduction of the Mahishis of, of Krishna, all is illusion. Bhagavan Sikh is not speaking to Sanatan. Sanatan, all illusion. Jogmaya. It is not true. But in Skandapurana, it is a Krishna, uh, one hunter throwing arrow. It, it hit the leg of Krishna. Krishna is going to die. His body was burnt up. And then the naval person running or you know, throwing the ocean, going in his, you know, this. After that, Purushottam All wrong. Totally wrong, wrong conception. It is written, Krishna 
in front of all demigods, Brahma, Sankar, Krishna sitting in the chariot and going up and up, up and up. All their prayer, everything, Krishna going up. In Bhagavatam. So when there is some contradic contradiction among Shastras, we can accept the Siddhanta Vichar of Bhagavatam. And at all this kind of concession must be there to, to make people full. It's very necessary. They can express some doubt. Oh, it's very, so it cannot be so. So, Bhagavan is very clever. So let them fight among themselves and those sadhus, they let them go and get the lotus feet of Krishna. Confusion, purposely. Purposely Bhagavan arranges this kind of conception. At that day I was speaking in Brihad Bhagavatam Mrito, that, that particular thing. is an arrangement. I was discussing that day. So, is the arrangement of Yoga Maya. So that people can be in confusion, they cannot understand, they cannot, who is Krishna, how to get Krishna, they cannot understand. This way, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu speaking, they all are in confusion. Actually, this is called Yoga Maya. Yoga Maya is going to make confusion among them. So that they cannot realize. It's all secret. It's not so. This way, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu speaking to Sanatan Gosai, all abduction of abduction of all the Mahishis, all done by Krishna in the form of in the form of all you know tribal, coal wheel, all tribal, coming in the form of Krishna in front of Arjuna and fighting. Arjuna is defeated and abducted. But I have not so. All wrong. And Jadavas, they are in fighting. All arranged by Yogamaya. All arranged by Yogamaya. Very secret philosophy there. How those demigods, I mean, how those, you know, those who are coming from heavens, they, they are coming and originally those uh, eternal parsad of Jodhubangsa, they are there. You will have to follow all pure Guru Vaishnava. They can explain you. No confusion can stand. Follow, like from heaven, our who coming, the our who is the our Bamandev, Bamandev also coming, all from different Bamand, all they are coming, and their wife also, their Sakti also coming to help Leela, to help for, to enrich the Leela. That's why they are going this way. So ultimately, it is written this way also. In Chaitanya Bhagavad, Chaitanya Charitamrita, you can find the confusing statement. Like the Danda Vanga, all the Danda of Mahaprabhu was broken by Nityananda. But Vrindavan Das Chakur Mahasaya writing in Suvarno uh, Rekha Nadi and Krishna Das Kavira Goswami writing something else. So you can distrust, oh, how this can be. Actually, point is that. That in different, different kalpa, maybe when Gorang Mahapu came before, that time it happened. So it is, it is eternally present. So Bindavan Dasta Guru uh, saw that way, whereas Krishna Dasta Guru saw that way. Both right. It's a solution. Otherwise, you can develop confusion or useless. You can throw everything and go away. You can leave even bhajan. People express some doubt about my strict. Judgment. They don't understand. That I am speaking about Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. I am speaking about Bhakti Mithal Prabhupada. Follow. So, restrictions are there. I will have to follow. I never hate anybody, but I will have to follow the procedure shown by. Somebody is speaking, Maharaj, don't allow Kirtana. So, who told you? You can do Kirtana. But when all you are there, you can do Kirtana. But it is a strict restriction of Gauranga Mahaprabhu. How I can break? I never had anybody. It's a misconception. It's a misconception of Mahaprabhu told. Even Mahaprabhu wanted to show us, no? The restrictions should be there. Because this is so sensitive issue. Even by hearing the voice of woman, Mataji is some Brahmachari can develop some problem. I know it is, you cannot believe it, but practically can show you. I can give you so practical examples, so many examples. You come to me separately. Even 
the disciple of Vyasadeva Goswami wanted to express some doubt about one sloka written by him. How possible, Gurudev, how possible this can? Matra, Sastra, Vadhitra, Na, Vivikta, Sanavashet, Balavan, Indiyo, Gramo, Vedan, Shomopi, Karshati. Gurudev, this how possible? With mother, with sister, with daughter? What do you think? Vyasadeva Goswami is asking, what do you think? This cannot be so. So you change. Vyasadeva Goswami is not speaking anything. So you change. It's changing. After that, in his life, there was a great testing done by Vyasadeva Goswami. Vyasadeva Goswami took the form of one middle-aged woman and in a strong and hilly place, oh, Allah, knock the door, you open, I am helpless there. Entering the door, ah, you can give me some, that sadhu, give me place, fireplace there. So you can go inside in the camp and I can sit here. But night when, you know, day, you know, time, 11, 12, night coming, that sadhu feeling some attraction. Why? Why? Why feeling some attraction? Is a middle-aged woman. Finally, what happened? Is going to embrace that woman. And from that woman, Vyasadeva Goswami coming out, what happened, my son? Oh, my God! So you are right. Matta sasta vaduhitta no vivikta sanabhaset. Balavan indiyo grama vidyangsa mopika. I can give you so many examples. Not only one example. But time cannot promise. Anyway, we should go we should go out of the influence of Maya first. We should not have any conception of man, woman, this is. A pure sadhu cannot feel any problem in front of any Mataji. They think all my daughter or mother. But still they are going to follow the restriction of Sriman Mahaprabhu to show, to guide the whole world. Not that they hate. It's a strict restriction, no? They are going to say. That's why they are anyway. Today we will have to, many things I wanted to say, but nothing I could say. Anyway, excuse me. So, I am bound to stop. I will do so many things, but time cannot permit. Ananta koti vishnu loko namra padma jarchite himadriya pulo moja peranchi jabaro prade Vāñca kalpata rūsi ke pāsindi bhavaśa pati tānaṁ pāvane bhavaśna pyo namo. Somehow I have no arrangement. You know I am a beggar, but still I arrange some prasadam. Here you can take some prasadam, otherwise I feel sorry. I have to do. Oh, do kīrtan. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama. Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama. Oh, oh, oh. 
कृष्णा कृष्णा हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा 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 हरे 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 राम ताई गौर हरि बोल हरि बोल हरि बोल हरि बोल नेताई गौर हरि बोल हरि बोल आत्मा परिमिज्यते असो मत पुण्य गाथा सबनो विधाने तथा तथा पश्यति वस्तु सूक्ष्म चक्षुशैव अंजन संप्रजुक्त यथा यथा गौर पदार बिंद बिंद भक्ति कितपुण्य राशि तथा तथा उत्सर्पति हृदय कस्मा राधा पदाबुज सुधाबु राशि टू रियलाइज द लोटस फीट ऑफ राधा रानी यू लैव टू रियलाइज द लोटस फीट ऑफ गौरांगा इज ए एग्जैक्ट प्रोसीड्योर डोंट ओबे एनी बॉडी दे कैन मिसगाइड यू साइंटिफिक प्रोसीड्योर वाचक कल्पत्र